Well, we as a family have been working in the real estate since third generation now. And we've been working, uh, we have faced the crisis in, in, in the real estate market before, and we know how to deal with these crises. Uh, any crisis in the, in the weather and the prices and the market and the, um, whatever crisis, we have faced all types of, of these problems uh, within this long range of years. Uh, so to make, to make yourself, you know, first of all, real estate cycle is really, is, is a big cycle. Like every seven years, 10 years, you see the change comes back. Any cycle, I mean, the, between the, the bottom and the top, sometimes it's, it's a long one. So uh, that's good and bad. It's good because you have time to plan for the next one. And it's bad if you haven't faced it before, you feel like nothing going to happen. <laughs> if you feel happy with the prices, the market is good, and you forget about that something will happen in the future, uh, you will lose everything. That's why we see uh, newcomers to the market, and they fail with any crisis because they don't have plans for the future. And real estate market is like any other market. They have uh, ups and downs. Uh, the only difference is the longer cycle, as unlike the uh, capital market or any other market. They are uh, predictable, and uh, you can see them, but they have very short cycles. In real estate market, I can, as an expert, I can predict from today what's going to happen uh, maybe next year or the next two years. And the capital market, they cannot do that. Their market is faster. They can maybe predict for the next uh, 